Morning, my sister, my brother, brother. Where are you? Here? Trusting that you are doing well. See this glow over here. But nevertheless, let us get started. So happy Thursday. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. So how is your day thus far? Hope that you are doing well, my sister, my brother. So let us get into our topic. E shall receive power. Don't we want the power of the Holy Spirit in our lives? So let us go ahead and bow for prayer. Father God, I thank you, Father God, for this beautiful day, Father God. Right now, Father God, I ask you that you would decrease me, Father God, so that you will be increased. Allow your Holy Spirit, Father God, to take full control. I thank you in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. So let's get into divine message in human language. And it stayed here. God, who at Sanjo, um, has son God, who at Sanjo times and driven manner, spake in time past unto the fathers by the prophet, had in these last days spoken unto us by his son, whom he has appointed heir of all things, by whom also he made the world by whom also he made the world. This is coming from Hebrews 1, verses 1 and 2. Father God, I ask you, Father God, to take full control. Father God, I thank you for hearing. Thank you for answering. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. And the state, the Bible is not given to us in grand superhuman language. Jesus, in order to reach man where he is, took humanity. The Bible must be given in the language of man. Everything that is human is imperfect. Everything that is human is imperfect. Different meanings and expressed by the same words, there is not one word for each distinct idea. The, the Bible, the Bible was given for practical purposes. The stems of mind are different. All do not understand expressions and statement alike. Some understand the statement of the scripture to suit their own particular mind and cases. Prepossessions, prejudice, and passion have a strong influence to darken the understanding and confuse the minds even in reading the word of holy right. The Bible is written by inspired man but it is not God mode of thought and expression. It is that of humanity. God as a writer is not represented. Let me repeat that. God as a writer is not represented. Men are often say such an expression is not like God, but God has not put himself in words, in logic, in the end, let me see, in eloquence or trials of the Bibles. The writers of the Bibles were God's pen man, not his pen. Let me repeat that. The writers of the Bible were God pen man, not his pen. Look at the different writers. It is not the word of the Bible that are inspired. Mm, let me repeat that. It is not the words of the Bible that are inspired, but the men that were inspired. Mm, that's a different twist. Let me repeat that. It is not the word of the Bible that are inspired, but the men that were inspired. Inspiration act not on the man's word or his expression, but on the man himself whom under the influence of the Holy Ghost is subdued with thoughts. But the word received the impress, the impress of the individual mind. The divine mind is diffused. The divine mind and will is combined with the human mind and will. Thus the utterance of the man are the words of God. Let me repeat that. The divine mind and will is combined with the human mind and will. Thus, the utterance of the man are the word of God. So that concludes my topic, my sister and brother. Divine message in human language. Let us bow for prayer. Father God, I thank you for this message, Father God. 
that we have a clear understanding, Father God, that man were inspired, Father God, to write your words down for us, Father God. And we thank you, Father God, for choosing the individual that you chosen to express your thought to us, Father God. So, Father God, I ask you to be with each and every one of us, Father God. You know our individual struggles, Father God. So we ask you for the power and the wisdom to continue to search the Bible for ourselves. Search like we were searching for treasures, Father God. Father God, we thank you for hearing and we thank you for answering. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. Okay, my sisters and brothers. So, if this was a blessing to you, you know the procedure hey my brother how are you how are you how are you hope that you are well mm, i love you i love you i love you love you i love you i love you so um i will probably talk to you probably maybe let me see maybe later today maybe later today if it's not too late if i'll call you later 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 um my mom and i was talking about you of course and so, um, my sister and brother, thank you so much for here. Thank you for stopping by. So if this was a blessing to you. Can you just do me the favor? Go over to YouTube under Burdell Warrior and just share the information. See, I got this glow on my head. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. So can you go over to YouTube and share the information? And while you're there, thank you for uh, supporting my ministry. And for those of you that would like to continue, go to bit.ly backslash spiritual warfare 21 second book bit.ly backslash the number 15 compelling reasons 2022 and for those of you who would like to tell your story you can go to bit.ly tell your story 2022 so thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to stop by here today may god continue to ritual bless you and your family but before you go, we normally do four hugs for survival. And we know it's eight for maintenance and then it's 12 for growth. But we only do the four. And remember, hugs is good for the immune system. We got to strengthen our immune system. And especially since we're going to soon going into the fall months. So we need to make sure that we are doing everything we can to strengthen our immune system. So look at that glow right there. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Okay, so let's go four hugs here we go one two three one more four thank you my sister and brother i love you appreciate you until tomorrow tomorrow i'm going to be early as well i don't know her early but i will be early tomorrow as well so with my sister and brother i love you appreciate you until then be blessed and take care